on 12 News, we're helping keep you and your family safe around water and with our Water Watch campaign. 12 News journalist Tram Mai joins us once again from the YMCA in Ahwatukee. Hey, Tram. Yeah, Dave and I have been out here all afternoon long with our team of experts, Matt from Gilbert Fire. You've been with EMS and Fire for over 10 years. You're the first ones out to these awful, awful scenes. Tell us what you see and the importance of the ABCs. Absolutely. I think what we see oftentimes is it's just a simple lapse in judgment or it's a mis it's just a simple mistake. They left the door open or something like that. And that's why the ABCs are so important. Adult supervision, we need to have barriers in place and people in that home need to have CPR. For adult supervision, you need to have an assigned water watcher, somebody who's watching the surface of that water in 20 to 30 minute intervals because our eyes start to get fatigued after about 20 minutes. They need to be somebody who is not drinking, who is not reading a book and who is absolutely, especially today, not on their cell phones. So, so many times somebody is watching the water and we respond to a drowning at that address yeah. because it's they've missed where's the child after a few minutes they look at the bottom of the pool and the child is fully submerged under the surface oh, that is just awful and and again it's your undivided attention absolutely Absolutely, you are dedicated to watching the surface of that water. Also, a good reminder, for, especially for the water watcher, have your children in bright colored swimsuits. It has been proven that bright colors, you can see them uh, much, much better in the bottom of the pool. Light gets distorted, so even if it's like a bright blue or like a, a, a darker-ish color, um, you can't see them once the light gets distorted. Excellent point. Well, one of the ABCs is, of course, CPR. How do people get certified? Does the Y teach that? Of course the Y teaches it and of course the, the classes and the courses that you could take are critically important, right? So adult supervision, barriers to entry, classes, and it's not just your CPR first aid, it's also swimming lesson classes uh, for your kids as well. But that is critically important to be certified um, and to take that step into uh, preventing any incident that could be happening. And you could set up classes for your whole neighborhood if you want. That's right. So the YMCA offers classes that you can come to the YMCA to take CPR first aid courses or we can come to you if you have a group of people in your community, in your HOA, in your corporation, uh, we'd be happy to come out and, uh, and certify any individual we can. Good idea to get certified if you're a babysitter. That's right, absolutely. So uh, certified babysitters are hard to come by, and so having them with that certification is, is really important to a lot of parents these days to keep your children as safe as possible. Okay, certification for CPR. Yeah. So many proactive measures on top of the swim lessons, not just for kids, but also for adults. All right, thank you both. We're going to have more from you and even some demos coming up in our next half hour. Again, don't forget all the resources, all the info on our website, 12news.com slash water watch. Mark and Caribe, back to you. Such important.